Hey everybody, and welcome back to the Stanley Parable. Uh, last time we left off with a little bit of narration once I started standing still. Thankfully I had a save uh, just before that, so I'm waiting to see if I can get it to happen again. Come on. Come on. You wanted to say something so badly about me standing still last time. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Stanley just stood there doing nothing at all. He seems to think I have nothing better to do with my time than to sit around and describe every fascinating little detail of his inability to do anything. This is why Stanley and I are on such good terms. <laughs> I'm tempted to see what happens if I keep standing here, but that wouldn't make for Yet there was, there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Oh dear. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs yeah, to yeah. his boss's office. We know. We know, we know, we know. Oh my god. I'm sorry if the game seems a little bit laggy today, guys. Uh, the signal seems to be getting a bit uh, rampant. Weather is affecting a lot of the electronics in the house. Uh, I heard that if you pull back just before the door closes, you can get something going here. Stepping. <laughs> I probably just royally fucked him over. <laughs> Let's see, where the hell am I going now, though? Oh shit! What just happened? I royally screwed it, son of a bitch. What, is nothing gonna happen at all now? Am I gonna have to start the game over or something? Again? Ah! Even when you manage to fuck the system over, it still manages not to do what you want. Oh, come on. Fuck. Damn it. So every way back is still open. Or reopen. What the hell was supposed to happen? Hello. What the hell? Looks like I'm staring into a door into hell. Let's go. Oh god. What just happened? I'm going to hell, aren't I? Oh no. I am? I don't want to be leaving. Why not? Uh. No, well, that's not open anyway, so. Escape pod. Escape pod? Hell yeah. Ha 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 I think I really screwed him over. Damn! Where's Mr. Big and Mighty Voice now? Come on, Mr. Narrator. I screw you over and you're gonna be all butthurt about it? You can't say nothing? Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Give me something. Something, 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 something. Ah! We just keep going up and up and up. Oh my god. What am I actually going to get somewhere, though? That's my question here. I'm looking for the escape pod. 759. Fuck! Come on, floor 800. 800, 800, 800. Why is it just getting darker and darker as I go through here? Here we go. Yes! I'm outie. Oh. Oh. My god, the light in the dark. 
the escape pod. Oh god, no! What just happened? <laughs> Did I seriously just escape? Are you seriously about to tell me that I just escaped? If it, if it reloads back to the beginning, I'm gonna laugh. <laughs> no way. I actually did. I actually escaped. That's <laughs> so awesome. <laughs> Fuck narrator. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Ah. Damn it. My co-workers have all left. They hate me. We're aware. Nobody likes Stanley because he's a giant tool. And the game seems to be lagging out. Once again, I apologize for that. When Stanley came to a set, set of two open doors, doors he entered the, the door, door on his right. right. Bitch. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Well, I'm glad you understand. Glad you understand exactly where I want to go. This is a really nice employee room, though, or lounge or whatever. Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth it, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Yes, I will. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, action, action, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Nope. Once again, guys, I apologize for the lagginess. I'm trying to see if I can't boost my signal or get a little bit, uh, get things running a little bit quicker, but. Uh, inconvenient. That's all it is. Minor inconvenience. <laughs> I still can't believe I actually escaped. That's amazing. I screwed over one thing out of his narration, and the next thing you know, I find the actual way to escape. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now, in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, oh. uh, oh, are we lost? From here, it's, um, oh, left. <laughs> All right, let's actually oh, do no. it. Oh, no, it's to the right, my mistake. Son of a bitch. No, Motherfucker. No, Damn it! No, not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? Quit juking it's me! Really... Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? You fucking dick! Quit fucking juking me! Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left, right. Yep, yep. Okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. You know, that, that close is too late on me. I'm gonna die. Fuck it! Oh, okay. Right in my face. Thanks, jackass. Holy sh... No! No! No, 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 <laughs> no. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Quick, Stanley, close your eyes. Okay, okay, okay. Hell no! We just have to get back to, um... What did I just come across? I'm kidding. It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about, rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. Oh god, time, again. Suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? <laughs> okay. From the top. Wait, 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 not again. So I stumbled across one, two secrets now that he didn't want me to do. You see what happens when you disobey the voices in your head, everybody? You find a lot of interesting secrets and things that it doesn't want you to know about. Well, that's actually all the time I have for this episode, um, and I will see you guys later.